Hi everyone. Um, welcome back to my channel. Today we have like a mukbang, a, a Korean mukbang. So what do we have? We have chicken, soy garlic, right? Oh yeah, this is my friend Michael. He'll be like helping me eat. Yeah, we'll be helping her eat. Yeah, he's he's okay. He's a he's he's kind of cool, but just a bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. So like we have like what soy garlic, soy garlic, burnt chicken, sweet and spicy, sweet and spicy. We have a few chips. Also for free. Like, it was yeah. for free because we probably like bought like a lot. Um, corn cheese, corn cheese, tteokbokki, tteokbokki with cheese, kimchi pancake. Very nice. So we'll try one first. Yeah. Yeah. How's it taste? Really nice. Do you like it? Yeah, what I like you, it. What did you get? What? Which one did you get? The sweet and spicy. The sweet. The sweet and spicy. Is it spicy? No, it was just sweet and spicy. Mmm. 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 Let's pick a loose piece. Try them. Mm. Slice. Mm. There you go. Mm. Oh. Sauce. oh my god. Oh my god. This is like proper mukbang. I can't believe I'm doing it. Mm. I, I'm getting some of that. Oh my god. Oh shit. True. Like, I like. I really like Stephanie Sue, which is why I'm like inspired to do like these videos now. She does like true crime stuff. She does true crime stuff, but I'm too lazy to research. So I'm going to be like gossiping and talking shit instead. So like basically, right? I don't know if you like, you probably know from the title, but like someone's like in like deep shit right now, right? Her name is Song Ji -ha. And she's from Singles Inferno, if you guys know. It's like pretty hot on Netflix. Have you watched it? No. <sighs> okay. So, okay. So basically, like, there's these like contestants, right? I think yeah. there's like 12 or something. So Song Jia, this girl, um, is one of them. She has a YouTube channel called Free Zia, right? Yeah. And she's getting a lot of heat right now because she wore fake items on the show. I actually watched Singles Inferno for her because I saw her on Instagram and stuff and I was like, oh my gosh, she looks so gam like glamorous. She's like so extra, right? And like, cause she's like wearing like fucking like Dior tube tops and stuff like that in like an island. Yeah, on an island. On, on an island. So, and everyone was like kind of like wearing casual where she was like full makeup, full like beat face and everything. And then I was like, oh my god, she's so extra. Like, she, like I like her. Like, hmm. So that's why I chose to watch it. Well, watch it for her, kind of. But I fell in love with like most of a lot of the contestants too. Okay. Like some of them are really, really cool. Three guys like basically chased her around because like a lot of like guys really liked her. Like in the show, I feel like her personality was like kind of bland. What do you mean bland? Like she like doesn't talk. She says like one word every single time. She's like. Oh yeah. Oh really? Stuff like that. So I went on her YouTube channel. Oh my gosh, she's like so cute on there. And like a lot of her personality is like more shown on her YouTube channel. Oh, milk is bottle, so you get the brand information. Okay. So let's just milk this. I mix this with soju. Why oh, you drink alcohol? PG rated. I don't. <laughs> I don't drink alcohol. What is alcohol? I don't even know what that is. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. What is it? I only know Milkus. <laughs> what can you pour it? We only drink Milkus in this house. Yeah, we only drink Milkus in this house. Pour it in front of the camera? Sure. And it's not like I have five bottles of soju in my fridge. It's a lot healthier. Mm -hmm. Very healthy. Yeah. Yum, yum, yum. So basically, right? She like, you know, she acts like she loves herself so much. She like so confident and stuff. And I was like, oh my god, like she's so inspiring, right? The goals to love yourself that the much. Goals to love yourself that much to be like, I aim to be like half as extra as her, wearing like heels on the island. 
Oh, she was wearing heels in she, the And she was like, she had this like little handbag with her all the time. It was like a Prada, like a, like a pink Prada handbag. And I was like, oh, I need it in my life, right? But like, I'm so like, I'm like, why do you feel the need to like wear fake stuff? You know what I mean? Like, it's kind of like ruining, not ruining, but kind of like tainting that image of her like loving herself so much and being so confident. But the thing is, she feels the need to like wear counterfeit goods. Which I think, I think she did that, like in my opinion, is because maybe she had like more pressure on her, like okay. on the show and stuff like that. Maybe she felt pressure to keep up that image of her, stuff like that. But yeah, I'm a bit sad because she really didn't need to. She was like pretty and everything, you know. Yeah. So like you haven't watched it, right? But like no. basically this girl on there, like people really like her. Her name is Year One. Year yeah. One? Year okay. One, right? Oh, I might be wrong. But like she got like barely any screen time. She only got like one like really big scene where like um there's this new guy that came into like the island. It's similar to like The Gate Crashes in Bachelor? Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, Bachelor and Bachelorette. Yeah. Where like, oh it's like been like a few days and then like these new people come in, this like imposters, they come in and like this guy, oh my god, he's like so so hot. He <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 So like, um, he's actually like one of the dancers for Sunmi. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, but by now, Gia already has like a guy that really likes her. Actually, no, she had two. Only two. Uh, only two. She mm. had two people that already liked her. Oh my god! And like, Joy Sihun or something. He like followed her around, like a so, little like, puppy, oh, legit, yeah. because she liked. Um, the other guy more, Hyun Sung. She was talking to him and she was like, um, kind of going to the beach with him and stuff. And you just see him in the background. That's sad. Simp. <laughs> Simp. Um, Kwon Chi Sung. Yeah, sure. Hey, how are you? Yeah. Dude, what am I doing? I'm so dumb. Oh my <sighs> god. No. Yeah. So basically, like, she already has someone interested in her, right, Hyun Jung? But this guy came in and rocked everyone, you know, it was like, everyone was shook, you know, I was shook right. because he was so hot. <laughs> Can he really be that hot? Yeah. Uh, fair enough. Well, right. what, what kind of question is that? Sorry. Rhetorical? Rhetorical. Rhetorical. There was this one guy, right? Yeah. He liked this like one girl. I think his name is <laughs> Moon Sehun. Yeah, I got that one kind of right. And he liked this contestant called Shin Ji Yeon. Okay. She was pretty popular too. She had this, there was like this um, controversy about colorism. Where, colorism? Yeah, because like they were always commenting on the contestants like skin color. Oh, like their skin tone. Like... Yeah, so Ji Yeon, she was like, oh, she's so pure. She's so white kind of thing. There's this like other girl named Seol Yeon and like she was like a bit more tan. And they were like, oh my gosh, she fits that island look or something like that. Like, I'm not like... Um, saying like exactly what they said, but that was kind of like what they were like inferring. Mm. Yeah, that's a really odd thing to say. Yeah, it kind of leaves a bad taste in my mouth, you know. Yeah, so Moon Se Hoon, he really liked this girl, but like she was interested in this other guy named Jin Tech. Okay. Jin yeah, Tech. he. Um, but then the thing is, they take so like if they win something or whatever, they take um a person that they like to um. Hotel, motel like thing. a hotel room? No, it's like more fancy than that. Okay. It's like an Airbnb or something. Ah, but okay. I think they, they call it the island. And but the island, they call it the inferno. Oh. It's like, oh, I'm going to take her to paradise and bring to the island. Oh, paradise. Oh, oh no, they call okay. it that, right? Okay, all right. Yeah. So then um, Jin Tech um, took So Yeon, the tan girl. Mm -hmm. And I'm not going to refer, uh, like, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna use that anymore when I'm referring to it. I'm just calling it so young, yeah? Um, he was like, you're the only one that um that I'm interested in, right? Okay. So like, um, but then the thing is, he won the game or something again. So he gets to take another girl to the paradise or island. And with so young, she like, she picked someone too, because she got to pick someone also. Yeah. But she picked someone that would say no to her. So that she could stay in the inferno with him, because ah. she was thinking she was thinking that he would pick someone that was so obviously not into him, mm. into yeah, into him. So then they would stay together in the inferno. Okay. However, he picked someone that was interested in him. So she was like, mm. "Hmm, 
kind of strange. Like, mm, kind of sus. Does he still like me? You know, stuff like that, right? Oh my god, this is so nice. Mm. Has the corn cheese. Mm, good. Have some later. I'm going to open that for you. You're so generous. How come you're so nice? You're a nice person. Alright. I deserve to get likes and subscribers, so make sure you like and subscribe. Because I'm so generous. Right, Michael? Mm -hmm. I'm always generous, right? Yes, Kim. Yes, you are. That's what I thought. But I thought. Alright, I'm gonna try the soy garlic now. Is that how they do it? Mmm. Good food. <clears throat> Good food. Mm. So, he took Ji Yong. Oh, the okay. girl that Moon Se Hun liked. Yeah. Like, yeah really yeah. liked. Mm. Who would. She was depressed for like half of the series <laughs> because she wasn't really interested in him. Uh -huh. Right? She was interested in um Jin 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 Like I remember was shook. I was shook too. I was like because I didn't really see an encounter uh -huh. with them. I thought Ji Yeon would like like Moon Se Hoon to be honest. Okay. The whole series, Moon Se Hoon was like the chef. Oh, okay. Wow. Because the thing is, he wouldn't go to the inf um he had to stay in the inferno for so long because like he kept trying to like get Ji Yeon and stuff. It's like he was staying in the inferno like for so long and he kept like cooking for everyone <laughs> it was so cute i really like him a lot of people say that they got uncomfortable with him always pursuing ji yon okay mm. i i kind of disagree though i thought that he was just being like true to his feelings whatever right but i think the other people made her uncomfortable because they kept saying that Oh my god, he's so into you. I'm always so into you. But she was like, oh, but I'm not into him. You know, I'm kind of uncomfortable. Mm. But like, <clears throat> I don't think he made it uncomfortable like himself. You know, it's just that other people kind of talked a lot, you know? Uh, okay. Yeah. But he tried to give her a space too. And he tried to, one of the new people that came in, he went on dates with them too, I think. Okay. And like some of them really liked him. Like, yeah. it was like at the start, no one liked him, right? <laughs> Literally, like no one was interested in him, I think, I think. Mm -hmm. I can't remember, but like basically he he was only pursuing Ji Ji Yeon, yeah Ji Yeon, and like so everyone kind of knew that, right? So like they didn't like really like take him to like just the let him do his own paradise. thing. Just let him do his own thing because they already know he's into someone, right? Yeah. And these new girls, both of them were really interested in him. Uh, so okay. in the end, he was like, everyone wants me. At the start, he was like, I'm not used to people not wanting me. Because they're all hot. Yeah. They're yeah, only yeah. being hot people. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. So at this point, Hyun Jung and the new guy, the one that um, danced with Sunmi. Yeah. Hyun Sung, Cha Hyun Sung. Cha Hyun Sung. Mm, they both really liked Jia. Right. But then, um, Year One. Year One. Mm. Year One. Okay. Year One and Wu Shik. There's the other guy in Wu Shik. I don't mention him. Why? Because he has like zero screen time <laughs> along with Year One. Poor guy. Mm. The, they were kind of like together, not really. They were like really good friends and they were kind of like, you mm. know, flirting, whatever. Yeah. But we didn't really get to see that. So, Year One didn't get any screen time. I was really sad because she seemed really sweet. Oh, um, maybe she's too nice. Not good TV. No, she had a really nice personality too because, like, at the end, because Sung Ta Sung, Sung Hyun, the um, Sunmi dancer guy, yeah, yeah. Chan, he was interested yeah. in her a bit too. She was so cute. Like, they had, like, a thing where, like, the girls... <laughs> it's Kona. <laughs> so cute. So, like, basically, they had a thing where, like, the girls... Because it was new to the um, Inferno, right? Yeah. So, they had this thing where the girls get to, like, um have, like, a little bit of time with him. I thought that was really smart. I thought okay. that was actually really nice. Because all the girls kind of was really respectful to each other. And they were like, oh, I'll have, like, five minutes with him and stuff like that. So, they organized it themselves. Oh, wow. And I was like, that's so nice. That's, like, so cool. So, it's right? The Bachelor where everyone's... Yeah, it's not like the bachelor was like, can I slide in? Like, um, are you guys done yet? Um, I've been waiting for like five minutes. Yeah. And he's okay. kind of like, can I talk to you? Like, you've been with her for so long. Yeah, two minutes. Two minutes. Like, excuse me. Like, have you forgotten me already? Like, excuse me. You know what I mean? And so they had both the time, right? And then year one came in and she was so adorable. She, she was actually really charismatic and stuff. Oh, and she was like... 
so cute. She was like so adorable. Like I, if, if you guys saw it, like you know what I mean. She was actually so cute. And I'm like, why does this girl have like no screen time? She's actually so nice. And he was like, <laughs> Curtis growling. Tarsi and Hung like actually really liked her too. He was like, this girl's like really cool. She's like so cute, right? Mm. But guess what? What? He chose some to be up. Ah. They go to the island. Still young or is it too cold? Too cold, yeah? Good enough. <laughs> Which one do you like better? <clears throat> the soy garlic or the sweet and spicy? Sweet and spicy. Sweet and spicy? I actually used to hate soy garlic, but I kind of like it now. Ah. Mm. Well, you did choose that one, so. Yeah. I was like, you better get soy garlic or else. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah, kidding. Yeah, yeah. kidding. Yeah, I, yeah. I gave you choices. Yeah. A, a lot of yeah, a lot of choices. Yeah, a lot of yeah. choices. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, so he picked Song Ji and everyone was like, why? Why? <laughs> why? Why? Yeah, and I was, because he, he told someone, he was like, I'm kind of like, in between like two people, I'm so indecisive. Like there's two people in my mind, I really want to take him like, obviously it's year one, like she's so cute, obviously. But, mm. but, they did have an interview with each other after the show. What is that? I feel like a lot of people are going to be mad at me because I'm calling these people like the sunny guy or like the moon guy. I feel kind of bad because like I know that's not all they're known for, you know what I mean? But for the purposes of this video, I will I will try my best. All right? Hmm. That for me. Hmm. No, put your mouth here. Am I going to reach over? Does it like taste better because it was fed by me? I think it tastes worse. Hey, I'm being generous here. I mean, I mean, it tastes so good. Thank you so much. Well, I thought. Don't remember I have a weapon. <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. Weapon? What? Oh my god. Oh my god. No. It's a chopstick. What can you do with a chopstick? Hmm, what can I do with a chopstick? I don't threaten people. I'm so generous. And kind and funny and smart. Anything else? Uh, I'm, I'm pretty, uh, beautiful, funny, uh, kind, smart. Um, Did I say this already? You said it many times already. Ah, thank you. Because right. it's all true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Chip. What's your favorite Sunmi song? Ashina? Ashina, that's right. Ashina. And. Ashina. Pura pipa. Yeah. My favorite. Oh, yeah, I also do K pop covers, so make sure you check that out here. <laughs> and so. But then on, in the interview, she was like. She didn't care anymore. <laughs> Ah, oh, she's she done. Like, no, she was not done, but she was oh. like, I just wanted to enjoy. Ah. So I was just being my playful, happy self. Ah, she was just having fun. Mm. Okay. Oh, that's nice. The thing is, they can't ask the other person's age or occupation oh. in Inferno. They can only ask when they get taken to the island. But why can't they ask the occupation or age? I don't know. I think it's like, um, it's a surprise or something. When they get there, they find out their ages and they're like, oh. Was there any shocking ages? I have a too old for me. You know what I mean? No, nothing illegal. Nothing illegal, by the way. Everything's good. There's no controversy on that. Okay, just mm. yeah. Um, yeah, they were always like, "This is okay, especially Soyeon. I kind of get annoyed by this, but I don't know if it's like a Korean thing to do that. But every time like she asks a question and they answer, she's like, "Hmm, oh, mm. <laughs> Like, how old are you? Like, no, no, not how old are you? Like, because that was kind of. She was like. <gasps> She was so shook because he said his age or something and she was older than him. Yeah. So, 
Yeah, I was kind of like annoyed at her because he kind of she wanted to use like Moon to be like her backup plan or whatever, right? It was really annoying. I really didn't like that. And she said to his face, um, this I was like, okay, I kind of understand. She's being like, she's trying to look out for him, whatever. She was like, oh, I think you're making Ji Yeon a bit like uncomfortable, maybe stuff like that. Like I didn't think that he was, but like I can understand where she's coming from. Like as yeah. a friend, be like. Yeah, I'll turn it down a bit, you know? Yeah, looking out for your guy. Yeah. Mm. But the next day, when they were talking again, she pulled him, I think she was the one that initiated, but she wanted to talk to him about, like, how she's kind of interested in him now. Okay. Suddenly, after Jin Take, like, was interested in Ji Yeon or whatever. What a weird she, coincidence, yeah. What a weird coincidence, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, like, she spoke to him, like, again, and he was like, okay, to be honest, yesterday I was kind of mad at you. It was pretty oh. intense. They had like a really heated kind of conversation. He was like, yesterday you really hurt my pride. Oh, <laughs> a, okay. a lot of like Korean people, like Korean guys say this, you hurt my pride. I think Moon se Hoon won like a, a contest or something. Like they had like a like a game. The and challenges. And... Challenges and he won one of them. Yeah. He got to take someone to the paradise, the mm. island for the first time basically okay he's yeah. like been in that fucking inferno for like a thousand years like just cooking <laughs> for everybody you know like what a g good guy good, good guy, guy. Like, i really like him like this is my opinion if you guys like want to say whatever you want in the comments like let me know what your opinions are because i feel like a lot of people didn't like him but i really really liked him i think he's my favorite guy in there okay All yeah right. him and the sami guy because sami guys my type it's so, like good looking Good type. Yeah, my type is just good looking guys. Yeah. I don't care about personalities. Yeah. 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 Fair enough. I just care about what they look like. I mean, they look good enough. Who cares? They look good enough. Who cares what they do? Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Who cares about personality? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So basically, yeah, he's one of my favorites. Um, but yeah, he finally got to take someone, right? Yeah. But the thing is, he's chatting. He's like kind of chatting up with the girls. That's also chatting up with him. Um, the new ones, the two new okay. girls. They thought that they were gonna get picked. But then he picked Ji Young. Ah, uh, okay. Like, we thought that he was over her kind of thing. Like, oh, like, mm, whatever. Like, got these new people, whatever, right? Yeah. He picked her still, which I thought was kind of cute. Um, a lot of people would be like, you know, like, what? Like, a stalker. Not a stalker, but like, what? An, like, obsessive guy. Yeah. You know? Okay. I get that. But when he went with her, he was like, this is kind of like, to put me at peace kind of thing. Like, I can finally just confess my feelings and if, like, I get rejected, then... Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because he yeah. didn't really get a chance to kind of do that. Mm -hmm. And like she cried. I think she cried. She cried? She she cried because she felt bad, I think. Uh huh. Yeah. She kind of felt bad because she was like, oh, because every everyone was like talking to me about how you like me so much and I felt bad and stuff like that. So yeah. And like when we found out their occupations, she was actually like doing neuroscience one of the brain the neuroscience yeah, yeah 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 she she did neuroscience for uni and i that's shocking to me why because like everyone on there is like doing some kind of business so they want to go there and i think to promote their business yeah okay. but she was there like maybe to actually find love like wow yeah okay. she was like i was like damn girl you know beauty brains she got everything. Everything. Ah, uh, damn. Damn. That's so cool. And like, I think she said she wanted to do it because her grandpa had Alzheimer's. Oh. Yeah. So yeah. So a lot of the other contestants for um cast, they both, they all had like a kind of like, they, they're all like are athletic and they're all like promoting, like going to the gym and fitness. I'm like, I can't relate. I can't relate. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm just like, oh again okay sure whatever and they're like all promoting their businesses and stuff like i think jin tech jin tech had like a business at 23. he created a business for like tailored suits or whatever oh mm, he's like 28 now i think and he was like five years ago i made a business I was like balling and i'm like what am i gonna do at 23. <laughs> i'm i turned 21 and i barely have my shit together what's gonna happen to me <laughs> I like this. Milk is. I like this more. Actually, no, I don't drink alcohol. But if I did, I would like this more. Fair enough. Hmm. Or I would mix it if I were to drink alcohol. 
I would definitely mix it together because I think it would taste good. But you don't know for sure. But I don't know for sure because yes. I've never had alcohol in my life. Yeah, exactly. Mm. And the soju in the fridge is actually his. Uh, yeah. He's just like, kind of like, borrowing my fridge, like lending it to him. Yeah, because kind of she's so him. kind and because generous. Because I'm actually so kind and generous and stuff like that. Yeah. So, yeah. Right. Thank you, Kim. No worries. So after Melinda would like confess his feelings to Dion or whatever, she was like, "Oh, he's kind of a fun guy. He's like really easy to talk to. Okay. Like, hmm. Who's Jintek again? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Well, maybe not. Because so, why? Because why? In the end, who did she pick? I wonder who did she pick. Melinda. Yeah. <laughs> Winner. Winner! Yay! Yeah, because in the end, like, they had to choose. I think the girls had to choose. And now, so Sandia, that three people in front of her, she's like, hmm. <laughs> um, she definitely didn't pick the puppy guy. Really? That's for sure. Wow. I never saw that coming. I, I was shook. I was like, <gasps> Wait, were you actually? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe she didn't make it. The guy she didn't like the entire time. I know. Whoa. That's yeah, crazy. That's crazy. That's wild. So like, yeah, but then it was that other guy and the Sunmi guy. But I didn't really talk about the other guy, right? Who's the other guy? The other guy I liked her. Um, but but isn't Sun the Sunmi guy. You don't even remember him. <laughs> you don't remember that guy. I didn't talk about him. You didn't mention him. <laughs> yeah, I really did it. He, I just thought he didn't have a personality, honestly. I just thought his personality was going to the gym. Uh, see, he's just kind of good looking and that's about it. Oh. oh. Alright, fair enough. No, I I mean, I don't know what he's really like. There was just another controversy. Mm. Where he, after the problem, problem, the controversy of Sanjia, like, wearing, like, non-branded goods or um, counterfeits. Yeah, yeah. He unfollowed her right after. Really? Whoa. He's quick to move. Mm hmm. And guess who she picked at the end? The Sunmi guy or that guy? You take a guess. Sunmi guy. What a shame. What a shame. She picked the guy that unfollowed her right after a controversy. Damn. I was like, that is just. So shady. Like right after too, like you have to understand that people are gonna pick up on that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a snake move. It'd yeah, be I know. More subtle just to leave it. Yeah, we like I know, but like I think maybe his agency told him to do it. Mm, but you wouldn't you shouldn't do it like, straight away. Yeah, people I know. Notice. And like to do it straight away is even more like it makes you look like worse. Yeah. At the moment anything bad happens, just you Yeah, so like an agency if they did tell him to do that's stupid. Mm. Like, it's so stupid. Like, he would be even more brought up into this controversy, into this, like, gossip and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, because he was. Everyone was like, what the fuck? Why? Like, how can you do that? Like, she picked you, blah, 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 right? Like, you know, like, she wasn't following me. And, like, it, he was basically saying, like, there's no reason for us to follow. Like, is there a reason for me to follow her? It's, like, basically along those lines. And he kept saying, oh, GR is, like, a really good person. She has, like, a bright personality. She has, like, positive vibes and everything. Like, I really like her. She's really cool. Yeah. Yeah, I followed her. <laughs> And it wasn't because of the controversy, by the way. Just unfollowed because. Just cause. Just ba cause. Basically, like I just got the vibe, like just cause. Yeah. Yeah, just just cause. Not because of the controversy. No. My agency didn't make me do this. No. no. I didn't want to do this. No, yeah. you mean he did want to do it because he felt like it. <laughs> Probably. No. So yeah, he unfollowed her on Instagram, and she had to delete like. So many posts because of um she was posing with the the canopy goods the, the fake yeah brand right. stuff so she had to delete all of that and okay the thing is she had a video of her like a whole video yeah whole yeah her whole hole. video say that I'm so sorry the whole video of her um of Chanel things yeah so like she was like oh my god I bought this at a department store or whatever right and people say those things and they were fake too. That's the part that gets me because you are showing off like like a whole Chanel haul video, which is all Chanel stuff, mm. and you're showing it like up close too. Um, 
they i saw the agency from her because they apologized she apologized with the letter on instagram yeah, yeah and then the agency further apologized like i at the same time i get it you know like i can understand maybe she's like really stressed out or like pressured to like have this image mm -hmm. of being like someone really rich and coming from a rich family and stuff like that yeah but i watched one of her videos and it said that she she talked about like she did a q a where they asked her like are you like do you have rich parents like are you like coming from rich family and she was like i wouldn't say that but i like lived comfortably okay you know what i mean yeah and do, she majored in university of um um dancing but like the traditional oh. dancing oh like oh korean traditional dancing yes oh wow that's pretty cool right i was like that's hey, interesting that's really interesting isn't it i just i'm upset that not because she portrayed herself as a rich person i'm upset that she portrayed herself as really confident and like doesn't give a shit about what people think mm. i thought that was really inspiring yeah but because of these stuff i'm like so <clears throat> yeah so that, that's just what i'm kind of sad about but that's basically it um i hope she she bounces back from this you know everyone deserves a second chance no one fucking deserves to like get comments like kill yourself or like mm. i hope you die stuff like that mm. that's like what the hell all well, she does wear fake clothes yeah um but i'm not gonna dismiss or invalidate like how like in korea i think it's more of a problem or something like put the brands in a bad reputation like chanel or dior or uh, whatever but then okay. i'm like they're the brands are huge mm. like why are they gonna worry about one like influencer girl wearing their like fake goods yeah yeah so like I don't know. They were like, oh, that's. I think they were. I think it's actually kind of a bit of a law there to not do it. Not counterfeit goods. Yeah. I think the law everywhere. Oh, okay. But no one just follows it. I think it's like copyright stuff. Like. Mm. Yeah. Uh, um. Yeah, I just hope that she bounces back from this definitely because there was another article written um, that says that she was like really down because of the comments and she couldn't. Yeah, she was like really sad about it and like and there was like she had a shooting during it but she came anyway even though she was feeling bad oh, okay. and like apparently they said that her eyes were puffy from crying and stuff like that That's so sad. yeah so i really wish that you know she will bounce back from this and everything will be okay again and she'll keep posting on her youtube because i like to watch her <laughs> and i'm subscribed and make sure you subscribe to this video i mean to this i can't do this anymore subscribe to this channel subscribe to this channel and leave a like and stuff and yeah yeah and justice for year one so yeah i just hope everything will be okay that's basically it um yeah so thank you for watching this video and this will be for leftovers <laughs> don't worry we'll finish it um and yeah i really really liked the soy garlic. Soy garlic? Yeah. yeah. I agree to love it. Corn cheese, because I love corn. And yeah. cheese. Yeah. <laughs> the corn cheese. Love it. Yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Uh, if you guys want to see more mukbangs and like me talking shit, then please subscribe. Please like this video and ring the bell. Just do it. Like, please. You know, please put some food on my table. Let me do more of these so I can eat yummy things and I can be generous by also giving him food. Yes, free food. Free food. Free food for... Free food for Michael. Hashtag free food for Michael. Free food for Michael. Yeah. Do it. At least do it for him. He needs it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry. <laughs> so, yeah. Bye guys, I hope to see you soon. Please um, also check out my song covers and stuff. Uh, I also sing and I do some whole videos too sometimes. And yeah, I'm also wanting to do gameplay soon. Gameplays? Horror gameplays. And the TikTok? Oh yeah, and I'm back on TikTok guys. Um, so yeah, um, well, everything will be like linked in like my bio and stuff. All that professional stuff that I'm going to do. Yeah, and follow my Instagram too. I post on there a lot. Um, and yeah, bye guys.